Welcome back to my channel, Love and Lache here, back with another video. Let's go ahead and pull out the fragrances that have made my fall 2024 tray. First things first, your girl is going to be pulling from a multitude of scents this season. Why? Because I'm a gourmand girl and most of my scents are gourmand forward, right? So I wanted to go ahead and just let you all know the first ones that I could grab as I was grabbing, okay, from the collection, okay? And these scents right here, again, are not going to be the only ones I'm going to be reaching for, but they are the first ones that I've reached for. Make any sense? You get it? Got it. I'm trying to be stubborn, but I can use some self-love first scent that we're going to be talking about today is the Black Opium YSL Over Red. And I am so excited about this scent because I was so happy to get it when I got it. And it's actually had time to sit up and mature. So yes, 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 this smells absolutely amazing. It smells ooey, icky, sticky. I just love everything about this YSL Over Red. Let me just tell you something. Let me tell you something. Okay, let me tell you something. First of all, all of the YSL, all of the black opiums, all of them are clutch, okay? They are just clutch. If you are anything gourmand, the black opiums, they hit. They give what they need to give on the days that they need to gain. If I'm not mistaken, this is probably one of the last flankers that they did do for the YSL and the black opium collab. I absolutely love this so, so much. So if you all have not taken a sniffle of a whiffle on this fragrance, make sure that you get to your local Ulta, Sephora, Dillard's Counter, and just take a sniffle because it's absolutely amazing. If you are gourmand, if you're a gourmand lover, you will love this. It's so many fragrances that you'll be able to layer this with. Everything about this fragrance is going to stick to your cardigans, your scullies, your scarves, your every, just everything. I love everything about this one right here, definitely gonna be reached for, definitely can be layered with a whole lot of, whole lot of. Now there's two places that I just do not go and that's backwards and forwards, honey. I'm not gonna go backwards and forwards, pull hair and tussle with you down in the comments about the Fenty Beauty, okay? This absolutely smells wonderful. This right here has the girls tussling because it's not a first love to everybody and that's okay. Everybody don't have to like everything and that's okay. But this right here, grown woman. I absolutely, absolutely love it. This is like no other. You are either going to love it or you're not. There's no in between. There's no gray area. There's no blurred lines. You love Fenty Beauty's perfume or you don't. And paired okay. with the body butter, top tier. Okay, chef's kiss. The body butter is absolutely beautiful. I love it. It's like silk on the skin. I would not recommend this as a safe blind buy. I just wouldn't. I wouldn't, okay? You have to you have to love it. Spray okay. it. You have to sniff it. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> you have to be one with it. If not, you ain't gonna like it. You ain't gonna like it. Now, I'm not scared of lions and tigers and bears. Oh, but a goat. Huh. I'm scared of a goat, baby, because Coco, Mademoiselle by Chanel, don't play with her. She exudes everything, class, jazz, sass, pizzazz. She's giving what she needs to give on the days that you didn't give, but everybody else gave. I just love her. She's an old school roly. Okay, she's 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 been there. She's like an old pair of jeans. The more you wash them, okay, the better they fit. Okay, the fit is fitting. I love everything about this fragrance, but you got to know somebody that knows somebody that knows something about it. And I know I ain't used much of her, but I just got her in before the season changed last year. So she has had a chance to marinate. I can't wait. <laughs> Baby, that marinade give you that can't wait. I just am so eager to wear her. She's so peculiar. So, so peculiar. She's classy, jazzy, sassy, pizzazzy. I absolutely love Coco Mademoiselle. And this is the Editor Lay. But let me tell you, 
it gives. Every day of the week that ends in Y, it gives, okay? This right here, this right here, <laughs> first of all, this shit here, nigga. She's giving ghosts because she's almost gone. She's giving almost, you know, invisible because your girl has used over half of the bottle if the liquid would stop shaking. Y'all, I am under, okay, or right at my Valentino sign. This smells heavenly, but doesn't all of the Valentino born aromas, don't they, don't they all smell heavenly? This is the first one, y'all, that I ever got. Okay, and then I added on as I went. So I think I have this one. I have the uh, pink PP. I have the green stravaganza. I think I have the coral. And I also did get the Valentino Gold that just came out as well. Flanker after flanker after flanker. Your girl been a fool after a fool after a fool after a fool. I just been dumb, dumb, and dumber, er, er. Okay, because when Valentino comes out with a fragrance, your girl's going to get her. I'm going to spend a coin. I'm going to run up a check. I do not care. Okay, I do not care. The pink PP is really good to use during the fall as well. The Valentino Gold is good to use. And even the Intense. Come on, Intense. I don't have that one yet, but I'm going to get it. I did smell it the last time that I was in Sephora. I'm going to run them points up and get that $10 off. Oh, okay, then. I thought somebody said something. <sighs> Mont Blanc. <laughs> She's nasty. She's classy. She's very chic. She needs to be on all of the fall trays. This is so warm and gourmand to my nose. I absolutely love Mont Blanc. So much so that I try my best to savor her. She ain't no limited edition, but your girl be trying to savor the flavor, baby, because it's just so damn good. And, and I know that she's more floral based, more than anything. But I get an underlying note in there that said, baby, Baby, this is a beautiful, beautiful essence that just resonates. This right here is going to leave behind a scent trail like no other. No, I hadn't used a lot of her. But baby, let me tell you something. I was trying to savor every last drop. Okay, so much so that I barely picked her up because I was young at heart, okay, when I got her. But she is a grown woman now. She's going to be reaching for her, okay, without intimidation because Burberry Goddess, she don't play, okay? She quit school because she didn't like recess. She did not play with the people, the children, okay? She didn't have an IEP in school, baby. Okay, she came through valedictorian, summa cum laude, whatever you call it. Okay, she came out front line, front and center. Intimidation. You're going to get on, you're going to get off, or with her, you're going to get ran over. <sighs> this fragrance right here, let me just say, is one of the most beautiful fragrances that I have ever smelled in these two nostrils. Do you hear me? Do you hear the words that are coming out of my mouth and are you taking them seriously? Angel Cher Killian is so absolutely beautiful Absolutely beautiful, absolutely beautiful, absolutely beautiful. It, oh my God, this fragrance is something 
to have. Angel Share, Gourmand Lovers, go purchase this because I don't know, I don't know what they put in this, but I'm so scared to use all of this. I don't want it to be gone. And baby, the simple fact that you have been sitting and nesting. <laughs> Let me tell you something. Why you sell Libre at a toilet is something that I just purchased right before the season changed as well. Now, I definitely could have taken this fragrance, right? And cared and nurtured and loved this fragrance during the springtime and everything. But your girl was like, nope. Sit there. In the corner. Marinate. Okay. Bring your best A game because when you get through marinating and sitting, you are going to smell so deep, dark, decadent. I love this for me, for the fall. I am not sure how you feel about YSL Libre, but baby, it is giving, okay? And it's not really gourmand forward but it's fall forceful. It's coming through, baby, like some lemon pepper staple. It's coming through like some mules that are slip resistant, baby. She's coming in, baby, sliding through the door, kicking down the doors, okay? I absolutely love YSL Libre, y'all. I put this on the shelf and I wanted it to just marinate and be so beautiful for me. And I finally can say, she's ready. She's ready. She is ready. She's ready for the world. She's ready for me, okay? Dolce & Gabbana Devotion is a beautiful, eloquent, satisfying, relieving, Taking all of your cares away does a body good fragrance. It is so gourmand forward that it just gives you all of the spices in your spice cabinet that have anything to do with treats, okay? With baked goods, okay? With just it's going to be the brown sugars. It's going to be the nutmegs, honey. It's going to be the cinnamons. It's going to be all of those things that make something just good. Y'all, she has just really fermented. I absolutely love what she's going to do for me for this fall. Your girl is going to be around here smelling like a whole Cinnabon at the Cinnabon stove, baby, with the walnuts. Don't play, okay? I come to not play with you. I just come to slay with you. I I love it. Anybody that has Dolce & Gabbana devotion, y'all know, y'all know. We not gonna tussle. We not gonna fight. We not gonna play tug of war. We know that she gives. Well, but y'all already know she don't come to play with nobody's children, okay? She passes right past the playground, goes right on in, takes her seat in the drama class because baby... <laughs> She's giving. But that Dolce & Gabbana intense. She's giving up business. Okay, she's giving business. Okay, I just purchased her. And as you all can see, she has been being used because she is absolutely beautiful. Okay, she dances to the same tune as her big sister. Okay, yes, she does. You can look at the juices on those and tell that they are different. And I absolutely love, love, love Dolce & Gabbana Intense. Definitely worthy of the fall tray, baby. Definitely. Now, this next and last fragrance that we'll be talking about today is going to blow your minds, honey. Because first of all, it is $25 or less. But when I tell you the protrusion... Uh oh. Oatmeal cream pie donut. This is not of the kingdom. This is dangerous. That it gives is going to be absolutely, absolutely jaw dropping, back breaking, feet pointed toward the moon. 
Hey, it's about $25 or less, allegedly. Every place I'm at, I get compliments on top of compliments on top of compliments. That's if I wear this fragrance alone. That's if I wear this fragrance layered. But the DNA of this fragrance is never misplaced because the fragrance is going to be in your face, okay? She's popping, okay? She's not a, a quiet girl by any means. I always get compliments on this fragrance, y'all, and I absolutely love this fragrance so much so that your girl's gonna have to go online and get her about two more backup bottles. I mean, it's just that serious, okay? And again, allegedly, $25 or so cheap. What, what can you do? What can, what can you do? And that is Red Zara Sweet Temptation. Now, let me tell you, I had heard about this fragrance from a family member. And I was like, okay, well, I want to dibble and dabble. You know what I'm saying? In the Zara world. I want to be a Zara girl. But I had to actually travel to where a Zara store was. Because if not, I would have just been blind buying this fragrance online. And I just didn't want to do that. So I took a trip to Nashville and I went to the Zara store in one of the malls out there, girl. And baby, other than them having all of the Zara fragrances up toward the front of the store, I don't like that. Y'all figure out how to do something about that. You know, that's just, I just, it just wasn't giving. I'm kind of an introvert. I don't like being out there in front of a crowd like that, but you, you know, do what you do, Zara. I just appreciate it. Okay. Y'all, I mean, I mean, do I need to say anything? Can y'all see? Okay. This bottle was about $25, $26, $26.95, somewhere around up in there, but it is absolutely the F-bomb. I don't know what they put in this. But when I tell you the people come out of the rooms, they come out of the crowds, they walk over and they ask about this fragrance right here. Gourmand Forward. I absolutely love it. And I actually got a few more Zara's, but I tend to pick this bottle up the most. Don't ask me why, but I absolutely love it so, so, so much. And now that I know what this fragrance is all about, your girl can go online, okay? And she can actually purchase this fragrance without any, you know, recall. I can purchase this with, you know, my chest. I can purchase it with my chest. Okay, okay, let me just tell you something. Purchase her, safe blind buy. Gourmand lover, get her. Now clock that tea. And so we reached the end of the video. Thank you all so much for joining me today. I appreciate you all much. Thank you so much. Let me know downstairs which fragrances you all will be dealing and dabbling in for the fall season. I cannot wait. Okay, let's talk about it. Let's talk about it. Give this video a thumbs up. Tell a friend to tell a friend. Share it out into the world. And again, make sure that you all subscribe. Other than that, we will see you all on the next one. Bye. I ain't tryna be stubborn, but I could use some self-love.